Okay, we meet again. We are still under grade 12, uh, sorry, not 12, 11, grade 11 engineering graphics and design. Uh, under the topic of perspective drawing, we are now attacking a, a task five. Let us attack task five. So, uh, by look or by, uh, uh, let me not saying look because we have to confirm this is not angle 45 isn't it this is not angle 45 which means you throw away this set square but you take this one because you must confirm this is angle 30 uh, clockwise direction which means this one's supposed to be 60 anti-clockwise direction so we are given the top view uh, and the front view as well as the left elevation which is the left view of our house isn't it so the question they're saying uh, this is task five uh, uh, use the information given on the what on the drawing sheet on the worksheet and make a neat two points per, uh, perspective uh, of this drawing or of the dwelling this is the dwelling so this is the top view so the very first thing we are going to have a line from our stationary point like this stationary point once it touch picture plane it's gonna go vertically down so that is giving us uh, the vanishing point of our indicate by an arrow the vanishing point of our left hand side you understand so now to get the vanishing point of your left uh, right hand side there you go once you touch the uh, picture plane go down so our aim is to upload all of them page by page page grade 10 11 12 from there we are going to go go to other topic as well so you guys if you've got a question you can just forward them to us and then we look at them together so this is vanishing point of your right hand side isn't it <coughs> so now take this point to vanishing point Let's say this is A, this is B, this is C, this is what D, isn't it? Uh, the four corners of our house. <coughs> so there is going to be the first derivative of point A. So take this point A to vanishing point of your left hand side. And take this one to vanishing point of your right hand side. You understand? Then once you are done with that take point B, direct it to, to stationary point. Then it goes, want to touch picture plane. Down, down we go. There it is. So we are going to have from here to there. This is the second derivative of point A. So now we are going to have a solid line from here till there you understand so now let's take point d you direct it to stationary point there it is once it touch there becomes vertical down so from here till there it's going to be solid So there is our point D is a D not B eh? is now there. So now let's the, let us consider the height from here till there is the same as isn't it? So you take the height symbol, eh? the height of your house. Once it touch the CV, because this is CV stands for center version. You understand? So it's going to it's gonna go vanishing point of your left hand side and vanishing point of your right hand side you understand so now without fear or favor we are going to have this one solid have this one solid and this one solid this is the this is the left view isn't it uh, is this one is this one so have this one solid as well actually this is the front view this is the front view this 
it should be your front view so that your left view is on your left hand you understand so you must get something of this nature this side you must get something of this nature this side you understand <coughs> okay now again since we see that there is a line which is this one so that is why we just draw it like that so again here yeah, have the solid and this one solid <coughs> you understand so if you take these these ones they are not going to give you anything yet because they didn't they didn't say uh, expose the hidden details you understand these ones you can just take them for the sake of knowing that they is supposed to be directed to to where you understand so this one again to here and this one to here so then from there what is happening let's go to the loof let's have the loof now uh, we are going to take this point to our stationary point it goes once you touch there picture plane go down is this one isn't it so take the height of your loof which is this one from here goes to vanishing point and vanishing point of your right hand side right so there it is it's this one there it is in that point so now we are going to have this straight to the point that you just got now and then from there this one comes here you understand then from there this is the new point you take it to your vanishing point of your left hand side there you go you understand so now we are, we are going to take this point to stationary point the one that you're looking for isn't it once it touch there it becomes vertically down <coughs> there it go so from here till there we know which is now solid isn't it so that you join this one and this one so this uh, is supposed to take you less than 15 minutes in a, a drawing class or in an examination actually you understand so we are done with our walls and the roof so let's start with the door because what kind of a house that it doesn't have a door so the height we've we've just uh, confirmed that the height from ground to high the height of the windows and the doors that, that of the very same height and so from here go to vanishing point of your left hand side right hand side there it goes and left hand side here it goes right so now we are going to take this point and that one direct them to what to stationary point there it goes and like this we go so from there it goes vertical down which is this one there it goes so from here to there I am having a what a solid line from here till there. You understand? So there it goes vertically down. Again from here till there. I must have a what? A solid line. So that now without fear or favor, you know Oguti, you can close here. You can now close here. But then we must show the thickness of the wall from here to there is the thickness of the wall, isn't it? So we are going to take this point, which is that one, which is this one, 
Then from there, you take it down, vertical down. So it's going to be dark from here till somewhere. But you cannot draw it dark yet. Take this point to what? To vanishing point of your left hand side so that you know what is dark till where you understand. So from here till here. And now you can come back to have it solid. You understand? And take this one to vanishing point of your right hand side. So that is dark from here to there. You understand? So which means right there is now the inner part of your house. If there was tiles where you are going to see tiles there, if we were to section the walls, we're going to section uh, uh, shady, not section because it's not cut it. See, now I'm talking about sectional drawing. If we were to uh, shade, we are going to shade here and there. You understand? So now, let, now our house is saving a door. Let's put the window, which is this one, isn't it? Which is this one. So we are told that this point is in the same line as that one. So it's already there, isn't it? So we are going to take that one. This one from there goes to vertical down. You understand? So it's this one. You understand so is this one and and this one on the upper part you understand so which means you can have this one solid from here till here you understand so now let's come back to what to get the the okay is this one remember it's not this one because this one is the leftmost so the height going down from here goes vertically goes left vanishing and right vanishing is already there so which means I can have it this one solid and this one solid this one solid you you understand so show the thickness of the wall take this point to what the finishing point of your left hand side there it is then now take this point to stationary point <coughs> there you go so that from here it goes vertical down So now it's going to be dark from here till there. You understand? And dark from here till there. Then now take this one to, to vanishing point of your right hand side. But further extend it till right there. You understand? So there is the thickness of the wall thickness of the wall so now let's show the bigger window on our left view so this one is already there this one's already there so we have to just take what this one uh, this one so that we know what is starting here. our window is starting right here and from there Go vertically down. So it's dark from here till there. It's ending where? Ending right here. There you go. Then from there goes to vertically down. So dark from here till there. You understand. 
so now we know Oguti is gonna be solid from here to the from here to right there. Anyone? So this windows of ours is divided. So let's take this one. The middle it goes from here is this one. So it took like this already. Then the class there it is and from there go down so let it be dark there you understand and this one and from there let it be dark from here to there you and you understand so now to take the the thickness of the wall eh? is that one then from there is go down which is that one isn't it so now you take this point to vanishing point of your was there are no curtain most they we, they didn't told you that there are, there are curtains so which means of course you are going to see the thickness of the wall even though there are glasses you you understand you understand so now you take this one to vanishing point of your left hand side yes so that is it. If we were to shade the wall, we are going to shade here. We are going to shade here. Then from here, going up, you understand. So that was it. Thank you very much. That was Mr. Nkosi for you. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and share. Comment guys. Even if it's just one word, comment. The, your comments, they are so encouraging. So that was task 5 of perspective. Uh, engineering graphics and design grade 11 task 5 perspective drawing engineering uh, graphics and design grade 11 see you in the next video okay